the Ukrainian Soviet Socialist Republic. The city of Pripyat. 1986. The Chernobyl nuclear power plant. Pride of the Soviet Union. Pripyat was a prosperous city. Since it had no military importance, it was an open city. Free, within Soviet terms. Its citizens were proud Soviets, proud of their nuclear power plant. The Friendly Atom, they called it. Chernobyl brought jobs, power, and opportunity to the area. In late April of 1986, preparations were being made for the annual May Day Parade, an elaborate parade celebrating the triumphs of the Soviet Union. It was a national holiday that everybody looked forward to. But this year, there would be no parade. On April 26, 1986, reactor number 4 of the Chernobyl nuclear power plant melted down, blowing a major hole in the side of the building. This explosion spread nuclear radiation across the Soviet Union and Western Europe. The total amount of damage from this explosion will never be known. All those who participated in the cleanup, called the liquidators, eventually died from radiation exposure. It took two days to evacuate the city of nearly 50,000 residents. For over 20 years, Pripyat has been abandoned. Residents were allowed to take only one suitcase with them. Many never returned. Today, it is possible to visit Pripyat with the tour guide and special permission from the government. Think of the city as a museum. It is a late Soviet city frozen in time, complete with abandoned apartments, businesses, and recreational buildings. Many places in the city are safe to visit, but scientists believe it will be more than 900 years until all the radioactive material is gone. Soil, livestock, water, and air are all contaminated with nuclear radiation. Pripyat may never be inhabited again. The city is overgrown, buildings are disintegrating. This once proud city has turned into a flourishing habitat of animals and plants.